friends, it's Zane here from At Home with Zane. Welcome back. Today, I wanna to share a topic with you. It is clutter or collecting. I get this question often and people will say, I really like something, but I feel like I don't really know how to display it. And so I feel like it becomes overwhelming and then it ends up being clutter in my house. So I'm gonna share with you a few things that I collect and a few tips on how I think you can take something that you love to collect and take it from being clutter into a collection. The first tip is this. If you have certain items such as cake stands, which is one of the things that I like to collect, um, or decorating books, uh, or dishware, those are just some of the items that I consider to be um, a collection that I have. Best tip I can give you is to find a place to corral them. If you have a set of decorating books that you like to use, displaying them in a nice way on a table or on a shelf, stacked nicely, takes them from looking like they're clutter scattered throughout your house to being more of a collection. If you've ever walked in someone's home and you see a pile over here and a pile over there and another little stack over here, that is presented like clutter. If you take those items and you corral them and you stack them nicely and you put them in a, a way where they're displayed, they're really no longer presenting a, a visual of being clutter. They look as if they are being showcased, as if they are a display. The other item is, as I mentioned, my cake stands. So my crystal cake stands, I like to display those on top of a cabinet. And by taking just three simple stands and putting them together, you've created a nice display and you've now corralled it and made it look as if it is a showcased collector's item. So with my cake stands, I like to display them out, keep them in the open, but if I had one over here and one over there and you know one in another place, it's not that that wouldn't maybe work, but I could see where that could be considered to be more cluttery versus more of a museum look or a display. The other thing I like to display is my whiteware. So I have this displayed in a cabinet. I also have some in our kitchen on my hutch. And again, if you take some simple dishware and you display it nicely in a cabinet, then you've given it a, a pedestal to sit on and you are now showcasing it in a beautiful way and it's going to be viewed more as a collection versus cluttery items. So I hope these tips help with some of your questions. Um, the bottom line is if you have something and you have multiples of those things, corral them together and they don't have to all be corralled just in one space. They don't have to be just on a coffee table or just on one shelf. But my opinion is if you take those items and you display them together in a nice manner, even if you display them in a nice manner throughout your home, they still look more like a collection than they're going to look like clutter. So Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Leave your comments below. Visit my website, www.athomewithzane.com. We'll look for you the next time. And remember, it's your home. Create a space you'll truly love.